today we're going to take you camping with us here in Montana. We're going to talk about this new business that's here in the valley that will take care of all of your equipment needs if you don't have a lot of camping equipment. And it's a great idea. They got a great website. We're going to show you around there. And also at the end, we're going to show you two native Montana girls that claim they are the best at roasting marshmallows and they have two totally different styles and we had quite the competition so don't miss the ending you will certainly want to take notes for the next time you go camping and you want to see who wins the contest I'm uh, David Deal, I'm the Director of Gear and Delivery Services for Right on Track. Um, we have three different primary arms of the company. Uh, first of which, the original, um, was their digital platform. And that is a, is a great, we still consider it to be kind of a game changer when it comes to trail data, points of interest, collaborative tools online, really to find out where you're going in the backcountry and to support that digital platform at rightontrack.com. We have the best meals in the market. Um, super healthy, super fresh, um, air dried, not freeze dried, except for the meat. The USDA requires that be freeze dried. They last 18 months, not 18 years. So it's a lot healthier, um, packs a lot of calories and super yummy. We consider it restaurant quality, so give us a try. And then uh, we're here in kind of the back end of the gear department with Right on Trek. We rent, uh, premium ultralight backpacking gear, high quality camping gear, and day hiking gear to uh, kind of an entry level for folks that aren't ready to sleep in the backcountry or the front country just yet. You go on a day hike, make our food, check out Avalanche Lake or something like that for a few hours. Um, what we're trying this year, and what's really revolutionary we consider, um, is our Wilderness Edge. And that is a uh, vending machine for rental backpacking gear, which you see around you here in different states of repair and cleaning. This is where we do it all. If you're familiar with Amazon lockers, we always, the folks that uh, are from the city uh, know what those are. So it's, it's a big vending machine for backpacking, camping, and day hiking gear, as well as vending items that you would need to support those three endeavors in the back country or in the front country if you're going camping. Over here on the left, if you order online, you can kind of do a bespoke order online where you set kind of what you want to order and, and take with you. And we will fulfill that and put them in these generation one lockers. These are what we used last year. They're just uh, lockers with padlocks. We tell you you know, what the combo is and where your stuff is. We put it in these lockers. If you just want to walk up, grab and go, everything's available here on these Gen 2 lockers and with pricing and pictures of what's inside. And uh, three different control consoles. You have camping on the left, backpacking on the right, and the center is stuff that's for sale. And that is uh, medical kits, maps. We, we partnered with Jake Bramante out of Hike 734. He, oh, yeah. He hiked all the trails in Glacier. And so he makes a great map, or a bunch of great maps. So partner with him, we're selling those. Some water treatment, propane fuel, isobutane fuel. And our most popular item is um, our backcountry meals that we make in Evergreen that are kind of changing the game when it comes to backcountry food. Um, most of us are familiar with Mountain House. This is a, a gourmet version of that. It's not freeze dried with the exception of the meat. Everything is air dried, so it's much fresher, healthier. Doesn't have the, uh, the lifespan or the shelf life of a lot of our competitors, but we are proud of that. We don't want to last 12 years. We, we last 18 months right now. Um, so that, we think that's plenty long and you can really taste the difference. You have to cook it on the trail. It's not a put hot water into a bag and let it soak. You put our ingredients into a boiling pot of water, stir it around for oh. five to 10 minutes, and you have what we consider a really good meal, restaurant quality in the back country. We've got some of our advertisements there. So if you wanted the backpack, you just push on the backpack, you add it, we have a shopping cart. So if you need, of course, if you want to 
Got a sleeping system. Let's say you also wanted some poles and a bear spray. Add that to cart and you well, you can change the dates, the number of days that you want to take it. You can also change the quantity here. And you see your total price. We think it's the defaults to three days, but you can change that. Um, we ask that you fill out your personal data. So if for some reason something gets broken or lost or doesn't come back, we want to know how to find you. So you fill that out and uh, then you just pop your card in the machine and doors start popping open. So this is a little bit different than the mountain house meals I'm used to where you just pour the water in the bag and let it cook that way. We are going to boil the water in the pot and then dump this in there and let it cook in the pot. Um, but they're all done in like seven to eight minutes so it shouldn't take too long. This is broccoli beef stroganoff, and it's the one that I'm most excited to try, personally. Uh, and then we also have chicken alfredo pasta and pad thai. And all of these come with little, this one has some crushed red pepper and Parmesan cheese. And then these have sriracha, sriracha and olive oil. So very gourmet, if you will. So Right on Trek uh, provided us with all of the materials we see here, uh, the stove, they gave us a packet with meals which also came with some snacks for after a hike or on a break. They gave us some cashews and cheese and peanut butter, little things like that. And then we also got the pots and a pan here and all the bowls and utensils that we'll need. So we got the full setup. Oh, Ooh. that smells good. Now, which one was that? This is the pad thai. It's pretty good. Huh. Would you like this? I haven't even tried that one yet, but... It's pretty good for a dried up package. Yum. Mmm. I liked it because it's not super salty like some of the, you know, dried. Um, you like which one? I liked the um, chicken alfredo best. They're both very good. I liked the chicken alfredo. It like gets me through the hike. You know, thinking Just about the meal. about the end game. Yeah. <laughs> this one is my favorite. Like I knew it would be. And definitely seems a lot healthier than the mountain house one the mountain house is like mostly noodles this looks like i literally just made like ground beef and broccoli <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah are you like yours to get all puffed up yeah i can puff up a marshmallow pretty good and i, I like i like to puff them up and then when I make a s'more, I use a graham cracker, my nice big puffy marshmallow, and I like to use one of those Ghirardelli chocolates with the caramel in the middle. Oh. That's like the extra treat. Okay, and so my talent is more, listen, it is a talent. Okay. I actually don't disagree because I'm really bad at it, so. <laughs> is getting the perfect roast, the perfect brown all the way around and the, the kind of top and getting it to brown enough that the center, like you said, you know, because then my favorite is taking a Reese's peanut butter cup, the graham cracker and making sure the marshmallow is brown enough and hot enough all the way through so that it melts the the Reese's peanut butter cup. But since we didn't have any of that, I did bring the, the, the staple. The standard. Yeah. So. And now 
what I do, <laughs> which is I don't really like warm chocolate uh, and I don't really like s'mores. So I will roast a marshmallow, but I just like to straight up burn it and then pick off the burned part. Bugs and roasting marshmallows. Yeah, it just goes together. <laughs> Bugs. <laughs> And so, the, the bugs in the marshmallows. It, yeah, yeah, that happened that on happens. occasion. Yeah. Just extra protein. Yeah, yeah. little crunchies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have never really met a marshmallow that I don't like, um, cooked or otherwise. I'm not afraid to eat the sponge sugar. Yeah. See, and I kind of feel like the wind is... Yeah, it definitely has an effect. Mm -hmm. It's hampering my abilities. See, but... Oh, I'm kind of deflated. <laughs> oh yeah, we're getting the puff now. Oh wow, that is really puffy. Yeah, you gotta keep the rotation going and... Then you gotta let it cool a little bit. Yeah. I'm kind of getting my ass kicked here. It's on. <laughs> Thank you. Give it the squish. That is a, What's the puff? a plus effort, a plus s'more. Mine's not bad. And I never really said that my, that my skill was the puff. Mine was, you know, the, the roasting, the, the good, roasted. yeah, perfectly roasted, perfectly browned. Thank you for watching our video. Please call, text, or email for more information, and don't forget to watch our other videos about Montana.